Hi Cancer, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Cancer, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Cancer. Okay, we have the five of swords and this is air energy gemini libra aquarius energy so this is a card of conflict this is a card of disharmony um there's almost an energy here of someone who's not playing fair even and someone here is it's tired of this because there's a lot of manipulation game playing um and it looks like someone is choosing to kind of disengage here let's see what the rest of the cards have to say okay we have the eight of cups water energy the Seven of Pentacles, Earth Energy, and the Hierophant, Taurus Energy. Okay, so with the Eight of Cups, there's again that message of someone walking away, someone abandoning this, someone feeling like this is no longer serving them, showing self-respect and honoring themselves by leaving a situation that just wasn't fulfilling. It's like this person is looking for something more meaningful. So you could have walked away from a conflict, um, someone you felt like you couldn't trust because this person was win wanting to win at all costs. Um, no matter how much that could hurt you, I'm seeing they let the ego get the best of them. It's like, this is someone who wasn't anymore operating with integrity. So it does look like you may have bowed out of the situation with the seven of pentacles. It does look like it's a situation that you had invested in a lot with that seven of pentacles. But um, there is this feeling of... Um, abandoning your investment here. Um, with the higher franchise, it's like you are choosing your values, you're choosing your morals. There's this feeling of walking away with integrity and self-respect. So let's clarify these cards, um, Cancer. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Magician, and this is Mercury Energy, Gemini, Virgo Energy, a card showing someone who's taking back their power, taking back control of their life. Um, there's this freeing energy about the Magician. This is you, um, you know, really um, taking yourself out of a situation that's lowering your vibration or bringing you down in any way here. Um, there is this message here about so you doing this is, is causing this person to respect you more with that higher friend energy. They are looking at you as someone, you know, who deserves more. Okay, so let's see. Okay, we have the Emperor, Aries energy, and the Empress, Venus energy, and the Sun, Leo energy. You're working straight towards your fulfillment here because there's this divine counterpart energy the emperor and the empress it's almost like saying no to something that is not right for you is leading you to someone who is someone who is a match for you someone who your values your morals your integrity it all aligns it's like you're about to enter into a spiritual connection you're manifesting your divine counterpart with the magician here and it does look like you're going to have something much more stable than what you left behind there's a lot of fulfillment here it's almost like someone this could be someone you have a family with because you have mom and dad energy and then you have this this childlike energy with the sun this could be someone who you create with you have this very happy energized future with here with the sun card so it does look like there's what you're leaving behind is not better than what's ahead um you are about to get something that is more fitting of you but it does take saying goodbye to something that isn't in alignment okay so i'm gonna pull out an oracle card for you cancel We have you're very close to achieving your goal 
gibbous moon yeah it looks like you are very close to manifesting something here something real something sincere you're on the right track you know because at this eight of cups she's walking straight towards the sun it looks like you are very close to that okay so i'm gonna pull out another card for you Okay, we have keep an open mind your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations yeah it looks like this this soulmate this person for you is coming after a very difficult connection someone is being released or a connection is being released and um it's like it's almost like it it's like divine redirection with that eight of cups energy okay so i'm gonna put another card for you cancer have morning glory affection and determination the morning glory which blooms for a day differs not at heart from the giant pine that lives for a thousand years yeah it looks like there's something fresh here for you and you will achieve your goal you're manifesting love here you know um authentic genuine lo long lasting love here and it, it, you're aligning with that it may not be someone you dealt with in the past it may be someone different Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card for your advice, Cancer. Okay, we have surrender to effortlessness. Stop pushing so hard. The art of living means going with the flow instead of trying to force the river. Okay, so it does look like there's something here where there was incompatibility. It was, you know, it was this feeling like you were up against someone who was very resistant to what you were trying to build. Um, so there is this message here about needing to surrender to effortlessness. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Cancer. I hope you have a really, really good day, Cancer. Bye, Cancer.